Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and my hair is crazy. Well, today I have a really fun video for you guys. Olivia and I, Liv from Sifted Clothing, she's been in my videos before, are going on a country thrift adventure. We're gonna be driving around the country towns and seeing like what thrift stores, antique stores, secondhand shops, rescue missions, like all those types of places have to offer us. We're going to be thrifting all of those places. It's gonna be random. We don't know where we're going. We don't know what we'll find. Yeah, it's gonna be really fun. Um, she's coming to pick me up here in just a few minutes and then we're gonna head out and just see what we can find. We don't have really any plans of like what we're looking for. We're just literally going to try and see what's out there, have a good time, thrift, chat. It'll be chatty, it'll be fun. Thanks for joining me, I hope you enjoy, and let's get to thrifting. We're stopping to get snacks, and what I don't know what's happening with my hair today, but it is not right. And gas, and then we're going to continue on with our journey. Uh, we might go to Biscuitville, we might go to Bojangles, we'll see, I'm not sure where, I'm not sure where we're gonna go yet. We could go to, um, remember when we went to that? That real weird junk store. <laughs> Wait, which was that? Remember how there was stuff out front and it was like crammed in there where there was like a bunch of leather jackets and the coach purses that she like wouldn't release from the- Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. Yes, we should go there and then we should go to the, um, why can I not think of the name? It's like the mission, the, the place that your dad's friend's cousin owns or something. And we tried to talk to the lady and she like didn't know who we were talking about. And I got that blanket that you really liked. So and all the books and we had our big bags. My dad's friend. It's like your dad's brother's daughter owns it or something. Remember? Solus Christmas. Oh, yes. No, <laughs> my sister's husband's Dad. family owns <laughs> Okay, either way. We're always eating fast food together. We really are. <laughs> I promise we don't always do it, but. We, I mean, I I used to never eat fast food. Literally really? Really never. And then since college, like my family didn't believe in fast food. They were heathens. Seriously. We like never ate fast food, literally. Virgins. Fast food virgins. Yeah, seriously. Bobos. There is Bobos. There is Bobos. Yeah. I, I think a drive through is the way to go. It's the way to go. We don't want to have to waste any time, take any time away from our thrifting okay. adventures. Let's go. This is our country thrift video. We are literally driving through the little countryside right now. And all the places that we're going are going to be like, not in the downtown area. Yeah, not our typical Not in the spot. city. This I is the country. I was going to tell a quick story. I, we're going to McDonald's to get a big juicy french fry and a big freaking Coke or something. Mm -hmm. And I thought of chicken nuggets from McDonald's. I wanted to tell people that <laughs> when I was little, or an adult now, I thought that at certain, you know what I'm talking about. Hopefully I get one. You There's know what I'm talking about. a chicken nugget shake that they, they pump out. That yes. Looks like a, that looks like a stocking for Christmas. Yes. So I thought that at Christmas time they put out stocking shaped like chicken nuggets. Like specifically. But that's like all year long. <laughs> that's like the form. Really, it is. They put it in. Did you only get chicken nuggets at Christmas time typically? No, I just thought, oh, they're they're stocking shape. <laughs> but then you would get them all year round, and they would be that shape. I didn't. It took me a long time to realize. <laughs> You're like, these must be left over from Christmas. Literally, I was like, <laughs> I was like, thought to myself, I was like, I wouldn't be surprised. As if it was more likely that it was a stocking shaped chicken nugget than just, just chicken nuggets before. in that shape. Oh, yeah. This is the Look beautiful country road. Olivia and I also really, really want to move, move out, out to the country a little bit more. There's like really pretty farmland and stuff like that around here. And we both really want to have like a little bit of acreage. We have such a big ask too. It's like not too far out, just yeah. far enough. Just far enough. enough don't want to be close to the road, to like set off the road, but don't want to be too far away from the road. Not too much tra or not <laughs> too much stuff to do to the house. Like not but too but much still a few updates. Yeah. Super, super, super nice, like uh, woodwork. Yes, it has to be still Historic. old looking. Mm -hmm. A little bit haunted. Okay, what are we gonna get? I don't know. 
came like this. <laughs> Someone has eaten off of this. But this is the, so this it is came the, like this. <laughs> this is the boot. This is the stocking. <laughs> We are at Solus Christus. Wow, that's adorable. That is really, really cute. And a little, oh, it's that like is fake so wood. Funny. Weird. We could use that one. We're gonna go inside. Oh my. We're gonna go inside. Look at literally what's happening. Straight out of the seven. <laughs> and see what they've got. It's really sweet. It's really pretty. Yeah, yeah. I think I'll probably get it. I'm just leave it here because nobody's gonna yeah. come. Snap it. Okay, okay. really not ready. Those are really sick. Would they fit you, do you think? There's seven, so. I bet they would. I could put some chunky socks on. Yeah. Make it work. Make it work. There's only that. Man, these are bikes. Throw them in the water. Now, time for me to go look through the men's shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Casually. Casually. We're leaving the first shop. You can't see it, it's behind me. Very cute. We got some good stuff. I'll show you guys a quick <laughs> haul of the first few things that I got. So I got this quilt backing. It's like, or quilt top. It's not backed, but I figured I could like make it into something. I got another little quilt. I got these two pink lampshades matching which I love and then I got these patterns for like a little project that I'm working on tell me what you got I got this cute lady I have a frame that I need something for and this is a I book. love her and I got these these are these little 50s um they're really craft. really cool made in the USA they always were like in pairs. I've never really seen cool. that estate sales. And this is a good deal. I've never seen anything like that before. This is a good deal on a lot of times they're in like pastel pinks or pastel teal. The white is really pretty though. But I love this white so. The creamy color. And then it's the oval handle. Yeah, it's Very really cool. pretty. I wonder if they're actually like food grade. It'll fit your house so perfectly though, even as like a vase. Yeah. It'd be cool if they were food grade because I would definitely serve water. Serve out water out. in it, yeah. It's Pulling out of our first little stomp. Where to next? Um, we can, at that one store, I'm trying to remember how. I can just look up like 
antique stores, thrift stores around here. That's true. You just see, see what pops up. All right. Totally a country. Thrift. A country thrift for, for sure. This is cute. Antiques. Yeah, me too. We're in Bithynia. That is, oh my gosh, that's my literal like dream painting. So we just left that country place that I just showed you and oh my gosh. First of all, quite the fella running. The it joint. smelled so strongly of smoke. Yeah. And then he like said he stepped on his thing so we could only take cash. But we found these like amazing nightgowns. Like Victorian era stuff. Like really crazy stuff and we yeah. were like, we have to get it. And then finally, Olivia has like some cash. $43. And I was just like, will you take everything? Will you take it $43 for all of it? And he was like, okay. Yeah. Well, we got like five or six things for $43. Well, I'll show you guys later, but it's really amazing stuff. So that was his This is the shop. But he was. I wish they had had more clothes. Like, what the heck? I know. If he had more clothes. You asked him, I was literally going to ask him, I was literally going to be like, hey, do you have more stuff? Because like, or where did you get this stuff is what yeah. we should have asked. Like, yeah. is there someone that has this? I bet you he, whoever runs it buys out of states. Freaking cool though. Last but not least, we are heading to a Goodwill. It's kind of in the country, <laughs> would you yeah. say? So, we're gonna stop in on our way back and see what we can find. Alright, we're leaving Goodwill. We picked up a few things. These are the things that we got at that antique store that we were talking about. I got this, like, skirt, which is really not in great condition, but it's really cool and it's obviously so old. Yeah, and you've been looking for one. Yes, and then this skirt, which is also amazing, but it has some staining. But I think I'll be able to get it out, hopefully, maybe. Yeah. So. So pretty. Yeah, I'm very excited about that. And then we just got a few things at the Goodwill, so a pretty good day. Great day. All right, we're leaving the Goodwill. You can see it in the distance. We found some pretty good stuff there. Usually I don't find a ton of good stuff at that Goodwill, but I feel like we found a decent amount of stuff. So yeah, we're gonna run back by Olivia's shop and then that's it for us for the day. Um, I'll do like a little haul for you guys later and then I'll have Olivia do like a little tiny haul and send it to me. So you can, can see everything that we got. But yeah, this is our country thrift. A country thrift. A country thrift, so. Thank you guys for watching and for following along. Bye. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. Okay, I'm gonna show you a little bit of a haul of what I got. I got a pair of these mid-century vases that I'd like to use for actual water at a party or something. That would be incredible. But I don't know if they're food safe. I'm gonna do some research. I also got this amazing little painting. How cute. She's a doll. And then um, these Nikes. Kind of big probably for me but i might just throw on a chunky sock i also got this cute piece of artwork i can't tell if it's cute or creepy but we're gonna go with cute anyways those are my favorite things that i grabbed back from my thrift day with olivia and i just wanted to show you guys really quickly the few things that i picked up I know I already kind of showed them, but I just wanted to go quick overview. So I've got these, oh gosh, 
these two pink lampshades, this really, really sweet quilt, which I love. This, which is actually just a quilt, like a top, it's the top of quilt, doesn't have any backing on it yet, so I might use it for a project. And then the two things that I got from that other guy's shop that I was telling you about, skirt, which does have a stain on it, and if anybody has any advice on how to get that out, let me know. It was really cheap for these two pieces, which is awesome, because I know they're so old and such really, you know, amazing pieces, but it does have some damage. And then this one has, it's much thinner, more of like a gauzy material, white skirt. And it has a little bit of damage, but not too much. So this is just a quick overview of the stuff that I got.